Hey guys, what's up? So, this happened. I'm not going to go into details on the incident, but again, unfortunately, that's what I'm left with. Um, it's slightly bent, I guess. You could say slightly. Depends on how you want to see it. So, I'm making this video just to show you guys. You know, like I said, I'm going to be very transparent and... You know, as far as the, the you know the car goes, uh, I told you guys I'm not I'm not giving up on it. It sucks to see it like this so much, but I'm gonna go ahead and uh, get it fixed and get it back working again. So uh, just to you know recap, I installed the mufflers and I went for a drive just to test the sound i wasn't even i wasn't even speeding or anything like that you know i was just you know i can't really stress the motor because it has only 46 miles on it so i'm taking it easy um you know trying to put some miles on it you know and so i went for a drive to take to test the uh the mufflers and so what i'm looking at is bumper cover and obviously headlights the header panel bumper support which i don't know if it just i don't know if i can fix that so fenders both fenders so you know it's just gonna show you guys basically that's what i have and it's what it is it's the damage is done and and I'm going to go ahead and hopefully make sure everything gets fixed the right way. You know, I had a cover here. So, yep. That's what we have for now. Uh, when I went to test the mufflers, um, being that this is a brand new engine, I noticed that there was a rattle here somewhere. I'm, I'm not sure. You know, and this was way before the accident. I noticed like there's a rattle going on in the front of the engine. I'm not sure where it is, but now I'm not worried about that. This is what I'm worried about now. So, yeah. Oh, so hold on. There's more damage here. Yeah, there you go. The hood is gone. Fiberglass hood. This is the factory fiberglass hood that they come with. That's also cracked and nothing happened. It, you know, as far as uh, frame wise, nothing really happened. And, you know, it's both fenders are good. The doors are opening like normal, like nothing happened, but it's all here. Uh, again, like I said, it sucks and you know, I'm not going to give up on the car, so unfortunately, it sucks that I have to see it in this condition. I would have never expected to be like that. So, alright guys, so I'm just going to leave it there and hopefully you see some progress along the way. But it's what it is right now. It sucks. All right, guys. So I'll talk to you guys soon and I'll keep you guys updated. So here's a little bit of progress. I took everything out. Okay. I took the bumper support out. I did not have any damage to the bumper support. That's Max barking. So I didn't have any damage on the bumper support. It's still straight, which is good. Header panel. It's all gone. My lights, they're gone. It's broken. Okay. And these were brand new lights. Brand new lights. I've changed the this because these brackets were bent. They were bent. And I didn't want to reuse them. I found this at the junkyard. Friend, that fender is gone. Uh, I have the fender's replacement that I got at the you pull it uh, so that's that's what i have so far guys um not major damage 
so I already got the headlights on the way I have the header panel on the way so yeah guys all right so I'll keep you guys posted I'm at you pull it here for Lauderdale and I found me a 98 I think it's a 98 I'm not uh, yep it's a 98 for Mustang looks like it's in good condition as far as the bodies the body parts that I need so I'm gonna start pulling those out and but man I, I need this as well because mine has a hole here so I'm gonna take that as well alrighty so I'm gonna check the parts that I need which are the fenders I'm gonna take out the fenders there's some information on the car and I don't know maybe little things that I need but I think this is the car definitely the car that I need is this that bumper cover it's nice mine doesn't have the the GT on it so I don't know if I should just leave it or probably even take this one but yeah all right guys so I'll see you guys soon Hey guys, I want to show you guys a 5.0 that I found. It's a convertible. I don't know if those are aftermarkets. It seems that it was a GT one. Flowmasters? Let me take a look. Flowmasters. Holy shit, the shit had Flowmasters. I wonder which series are those. This one was a 1988. That's crazy. So 5.0 with flow masters. Oh man, the interior is completely trash. That sucks. Let me see if I can see those monsters. I'm not taking them off or anything. Just curious to see what are they? I don't know. It says flow masters. But I'm not sure, I can't really see which series they are. That sucks. Looks like Super 44s or something. Around that area, but yep, there's another sticker there. Wow. That's crazy. That's another Mustang right there. And another one. These are the new Edge. I don't think that's a, that's not a GT. No, it's not. They're, both V6. Alright guys. I just wanted you guys to see this one here. Let's see what else we can find. If we find anything. If not, we'll go to the next one. Alrighty, so we got the car on and it's already strapped and we're ready to to get it going. So yep, that's that's it guys so we already got it strapped and we're gonna go ahead and take it i'll see you guys when we get there <laughs> 